today on MTG Unpacked, it's time for a double dose of chaos. That's right, we're cracking open two MTG Unpacked chaos mystery boxes. These things are my vision for how a chaos mystery box should be. So let's move them aside and introduce the patrons we have, Emblazoned Aegis and Eric Cook. Okay, we'll start off here with Emblazoned Aegis rolling one through three or four through six we get a six so he'll get that one and then one through three four through six okay so this one for eric and one left so stay tuned later in the month we'll be cracking that open all right thank you for being a patron emblazoned aegis and the theme this month is behemoth so if you have a prediction for what could be in these boxes dirty big creatures but what ones? Leave a note in the comments. Okay, so let's check it out. We have a Modern Horizons, Theros Beyond Death, Rivals of Ixalan. Ooh, there we are. That's pretty cool. We'll check that out in a moment. Journey into Nyx, Thrinville Drain, and Ravnica Allegiance. Okay, so how are we going to do this? We'll go something like this. Okay, let's check out the tasty foil here. Okay, we have a Dark Steel Colossus. So this guy is huge. 11, 11, 4, 11. A nice foiling on that. Artifact creature with trample is indestructible. And if it will be put into a graveyard from anywhere, reveal Dark Steel Colossus and shuffle it into its owner's library instead. Look at that foiling. Very nice indeed. Okay, so... Pop him over here and get cracking and the patrons get the rares, mythic spoils and anything over a buck. So starting off here with some rivals of Ixalan. We have a sun-crested pterodon, sailor of means, swaggering corsair, dinosaur hunter. And did anyone play Turok back in the day? Aggressive urge, gleaming barrier, exultant sky marcher. Cleansing Ray, Jungle Born Pioneer, Buccaneers Bravado, and Uncommon's Cherished Hatchling, Raging Regisaur, Majestic Heliotaris, and, ooh, what is this? A checklist card, and a flip card here, Path of Metal, Legendary Enchantment for two, so when it ends bad food, it deals one damage to each creature that doesn't have First Strike, Double Strike, Vigilance, or Haste, and whenever you attack with at least two creatures that have First Strike, Double Strike, Vigilance and or haste transform it into Metzali Tower of Triumph. So you can tap it for one manner of any color. Pay one in red, tap it, deals two damage to each opponent or two in white, tap. Choose a creature at random that attack this turn, destroy that creature. Okay, pop that over there. We'll check in the emblem of Watley as well. All right, moving on. Theros Beyond Death. So there is still a chance for at least one Titan. So we'll keep our eyes peeled. We have Deny the Divine, Nyxborn Brute, Relentless Pursuit, Nyxborn Marauder, Voracious Typhon, Snake Beast, Holy Moly, Scofoss War Leader, Myers Grasp, Towering Wave, Mystic, Daybreak Chimera, and Uncommon Zarkon of Falling Stars, Mystic Repeal, Blood Aspirant, and the rare is a Raster of the Endless Web. So it's a legendary enchantment creature spider, three, five, four with reach. Whenever an opponent casts an instant or sorcery spell, create a one, two green spider creature token with reach. And this thing was rather annoying. I was playing it in arena a couple of weeks back. And Grim Physician. There we are. Nice foil with a swamp and no table required. Are you playing something crazy in the arena? Maybe with one of those new Ikoria companions. And if so, which one did you pick? Uh, what's his name? Loris or something seems to be pretty popular. Okay, we have Harvest Guide Alcyids, Golden Hind, Returned Reveler, Countermand, Pensive Minotaur, Armament of Nyx, Thassa's Devourer, Gluttonous Cyclops, and he's just chucking the sheep down his pie hole like popcorn. Craziness, Sigiled Starfish, Starfall, an Uncommon's Riddle of Lightning, Thought Render Lamia, ooh, that's creepy. Fellhide Petrifier, he's just holding this Gorgon's head. And the rare is Scourge of Fleets. This is very much on theme today. Creature Kraken, 
Six six for seven when Scourge of Fleet Chant enters the battlefield, return each creature or opponent's control with toughness X or less to its owner's hand, where X is the number of islands you control. And they forest and satyr token. Okay, on to allegiance. So I think we pulled a shot clan the other day, but there should still be a few more in that box. It's been a bit light so far. We have Arrest of Zeal, Shimmer of Possibility, Feral Marker. Stony Strength, Undercity's Embrace, Blade Juggler, Justice's Portal, Final Payment, Act of Treason, and everybody's favourite, Shark to Crab, Fish Octopus Crab, and they've really outdone themselves, isn't there, like a Sharknado type thing in our Coria, craziness, whole bunch of sharks, and a 10 Street Dodger, Creature Goblin Rogue, yes, we do love the goblins here, Forbidding Spirit, and the rare is Awaken the Erstwhile. Sorcery for five. Each player discards all the cards in their hand and creates that many 2-2 black zombie creature tokens. Nice artwork on that one. And a Mammoth Spider Foil. With an Azoria Skill Gate and a Goblin Token. And you know what? I'm going to chuck the Goblin Token in. Because everybody needs a pet Goblin. Okay, this must be one of these Japanese packs with the pull tab. So it's going to be... Topsy turvy here, we have a mouse token, mountain, and nice one, Emery Lurker of the Lock is a rare, legendary creature, Merfolk Wizard 1, 2, 3. So this spell costs one less to cast for each artifact you control when it ends the battlefield. Put the top four cards of your library into your graveyard, and you can tap, choose target artifact card in your graveyard. You may cast that card this turn. And a Clockwork Servant, Foulmire Knight, showcase, so I'll chuck that in as well, Savvy Hunter. Commons Unexplained Vision. Yes, we do look at the commons on this channel. I know it's horrifying for some of you. Wicked Guardian, Dwarven Mine. In case you just noticed, Searing Barrage, crash, Crashing Drawbridge, Return to Nature, Fairy Guide Mother, Fling, Opt, and Fortifying Provisions. Okay, Modern Horizons, looking for the fabled Wren and Stimpy. Where are you, gents, or non-gender specific being? I'm, I'm not sure what it is, to be honest. Shapeshifter token, non-foil. We get this guy, uh, which is a ingenious infiltrator. Snow-covered plains, and the rare crashing footfalls. Wah, 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 wah. Sorcery has to spend four and a green, so rather than cast it from your hand, you can pay that cost. Exile it with four time counters on it. You can read the rest. Create two four four green rhino creature tokens with trample. And uncommons we have Pillage, Feaster of Fools, Valiant Changeling, and Commons Rocks Veteran, Putrid Goblin Creature Zombie Goblin. You should have a bath, sir. Magmatic Sinkhole, Weather the Storm, Nimble Mongoose, Umazawa's Charm, Choking Tethers, Bladeback Sliver, that is a very cool sliver, Reprobation, and Moonblade Shinobi. Okay, so there we are, Emblazoned Aegis. Enjoy the pools this month. And we've got this very nice Dark Steel Colossus for you. Pop him in there. Okay, Eric Cook, you're up next, sir. Thank you for being a patron. So, again, another prediction here. What will be the huge creature in this box? Leave your prediction in the comments. Pop that over there. Okay, so Modern Horizons. Oh, interesting. Mystery Booster. I, I wasn't sure if we had any left in these. Theros Beyond Death. A very nice foil. We'll take a look at that in a moment. Fate Reforge, Ravnica Allegiance, and Core 2020. You know what? I'm going to leave the Mystery Booster last because there's a chance for a Mana Crypt in there. Um, let's go something like this. Okay, and we will check out what is the thing in the ice. Very cool. Creature horror, but it's just a 0-4 for 2. Defender. Enter battlefield with 4 ice counters on it, and whenever you cast sense an sorcery spell, remove an ice counter from thing in the ice. Then if it has no ice counters on it, transform it into... Here we are. Ah, uh, that's more like it. Awoken horror. Creature Kraken Horror, 7-8. When this creature transforms into a Woken Horror, return all non-horror creatures to their owner's hands. 
devastating look at that thing from Shadows Over Innistrad. Okay, pop him in here. And get to cracking. We have Ravnica Allegiance. And I could do with a Hydroid Crisis right about now. That would be very nice indeed. We have Arrestor's Admonition, Savage Smash, Twilight Panther, Persistent Petitioners. I'll chuck that in. I still think that's over a buck. Silver and Brush Strider, Plague White, Justicia's Portal, Final Payment, Act of Treason, Imperious Oligarch, and the Uncommons. We have eyes everywhere, people. We're keeping our eyes on you. Watch out. Terramander, Salamander Drake, Knight of the Last Breath, and actually that Terramander was decent back in the day, I'll chuck him in as well. Knight of the Last Breath, and the rare is Rampage of the Clans, instant for four, destroy all artifacts and enchantments for each permanent, destroy this way, its controller creates a 3-3 green centaur creature token. And then Oars of Gilgate and Beast token. Okay, Fate Reforged, so I believe we could have fetch lands here. So let's check it out. We have Harsh Sustenance, Pressure Point, Whisk Away, Soltai Emissary, Jeskai Runemark, Map the Wastes, Collateral Damage, Formless Nurturing, Sandstep Outcast, Teemo Battle Rage. What is your favorite clan? In the Khan's block, I'm very curious indeed. Diplomacy of the Wastes for the Uncommons Destructor Dragon. Just Sky Barricade and the Rare. Ooh, that's nice. Ojatai Soul of Winter. Legendary Creature Dragon, 5 6 for 7 with Flying and Vigilance. Whenever a dragon you control attacks, tap target, non line permanent, and permanent controls that permanent doesn't untap during its controller's next untapped step. Okay, and a Jungle Hollow and Manifest token. On to Core 2020. I hope everyone's weekend thus far has been very nice. The uh, weather in this part of the world is warming up nicely, so nice spring time. Go out for a walk. Okay, we have Ripscale Predator, Disenchant, Moat Piranhas, Fire Elemental, Barony Vampire, Netcaster Spider, Befuddle. And we've got the stuck together cards again. Must have been that particular box. Murder. Dawning Angel and Uncommon's Captivating Gyre. Eternal Isolation. Bloodthirsty Aerialist. And the rare is Glinthorn Buccaneer. Creature Minotaur Pirate 243. With haste, whenever you discard a card, he deals one damage to each opponent. For one and a red, discard a card. You get to draw a card. Activate this ability only if Glinthorn Buccaneer is attacking. And a foil flame sweep. Look at that foiling spectacular. And a forest and soldier token. On to Theros beyond death. Going titan hunting. Or I would settle for one of the gods as well. Or maybe the planeswalkers. We have Nyxborn Sea Guard, Portent of Betrayal, Sunman Pegasus, Sleep of the Dead, Nalia's Forerunner, Lampard of Death's Vigil. Nyxborn Colossus, Brian Giant, Fruit of Tizerus, and Uncommon Slaughter Priest of Mogus, Reverend Toplight, Enemy of Enlightenment, and a Nyx Lotus. Nice pull indeed. Legendary Artifact for four. So Answers of Adfield tapped. You can tap it, choose a color, add an amount of manner of that color equal to your devotion to that color. Fantastic. And a foil, one with the stars. The Forest and Human Soldier. And actually, we haven't had too many of these in uh, foil recently. They're more common in the collector packs. You get two in each pack. Okay, let's... Oh, okay. So apparently, this is the point where I lose the ability to open a pack. Okay, so bear with me. Okay, we have a Shapeshifter non-foil. We have a Water Eye Witch! There she is. I'll chuck that in as well. Snow-covered plains. Oh, nice one. Silent Clearing. One of these so-called Horizon Lands. You can tap, pay one life, add white or black for one tap, suck it, draw a card. Nice artwork too. And Uncommon's Cunning Evasion. Glacial Revelation. Talisman of Creativity. And the Commons Magmatic Sinkhole. Gilded Light. Trumpeting Herd, Rocks Veteran, 
Nimble Mongoose, First Fair Gargantua, Mother Bear, Fists of Flame, Enduring Sliver, and Moonblade Shinobi. Okay, so no Ren and Stimpy today. We are really running out of packs from that box, actually, so I hope we get some soon. Pull the Ren and Six would be very nice, and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button for more Magic Gathering unboxings, and be sure to tap the notification bell to be notified as soon as new videos are released. Okay, fingers crossed for that Mana Crypt. We have Celestial Flare, Sensor Splicer, Sleep, Thrumming Bird, Demon's Grasp, Go for the Throat, Burst Lightning, and I will be checking the prices during editing. If I miss something, I'll certainly chuck those in the envelopes later. Lightning Talons, Thrive, Borderland Ranger, Wayfaring Temple, Blighted Fen, Gitu Warcry and the rare Whir of Invention. Instant for X and the three blue has Improvise and search your library for an artifact card with convert mana cost X or less. Put it onto the battlefield, then shuffle your library. And what else? A foil Iron Mirror. Okay, some nice foiling on that one. So there we have it, Eric. Thank you for being a patron. I hope you enjoy your thing in the ice. We'll pop that in there. Some nice pulls today. I hope everyone out there is staying safe and healthy. Thanks for watching and have a great day.